bring people who are sick, I just want to, I feel sickness all over my body, especially people who have got chest problems. Let's start with them. Chest, chest because I feel blocked sometimes, I feel somehow. You stand there, you have a chest problem, yes. Chest problem. When you're a pastor, you feel what they feel. You feel what they feel. You, you feel. Like now they're standing here, I'm no longer feeling it now. When, I, when you want to pray for them, you feel. You can describe what this lady, what she's going through. Sometimes in her, it's like there are bubbles here. It's very painful. I can't even breathe. Like things are inside you. It's taking me from my back. Yes. Mm. You can describe. This one, it just come and go. Mm. Eh? Yes. It just come and go. Eh? Yes. This one here, it's like it's affecting even your ears. Yes, daddy. Eh? Yes, daddy. Can you tell me how? I feel like there's something like a sound in my ears. That comes to your ears here. Yes. Can you see that? The moment we look at them, you feel what they feel. You, I look at this man here. This one is like very weak. Yes, did. Huh? Yes, did. So it's blocked here, but it's very weak. And then sometimes you feel like there's something like, you know, very hot. Yes, did. Huh? Yes, did. Hot comes, go. Comes, go. Yes, did. Like that. So you can see how many are there. So it's no issue of, you, you can tell you, you can tell them that this is the situation. The problem of a pastor is not his problem. Stop praying for your problem. There's no anointing that you have that will help you. You don't have anointing for yourself. You're, you're wasting time. That is why I have to be prayed for. You have to be prayed for. Someone must pray for you. It's not to be childish to be prayed for or to be a son of someone. It's not to be childish. Jesus also was baptized by, by John. The, I'm talking about the, the king of kings. So who are you? I'm sure you understand what I'm trying to say. It's not to be childish. Don't ever think you'll just emerge, unless if you're cultic. If you're cultic, they'll tell you do this and then you'll emerge and go and lie to people. You have to have a process. The reasons why you, you start to, to submit is because of your children in the future. You're not doing it for yourself. Submission is not for yourself. It's for your children in the future. When you don't want to have children, you don't submit. I'm sure you understand what I'm trying to say. Eh? So how you are faithful, your faithfulness in your submission it pays you tomorrow. You don't just wake up, boom, I'm a man of God. And now you are electing sons. These sons will turn against you and kill you. So these chess issues, a lot of chess issues, brother, that tall brother, come. Uh, this is like something that is pissing you. Let, let's hear that brother must not reach me here. Eh? Uh, at the same like time, my chess here. Eh? Yeah. Uh, okay, okay, okay. In Jesus' name. PC. This is like a demo, that one. This is a demo. Just go to him. That one is a demo. You're a demo. You leave this man. Uh -huh. You can see this one. This one here. Uh -huh. There's a pills. There's a pills that she's drinking also. That pills. Sometimes you drink pills, they help you. Sometimes they don't help you. You understand? But that peace has helped her. That peace. That peace. This was supposed to be worse. Uh, let's, hear, let's hear that. The peace. Huh? Yes, did you? You were drinking peace. Yes. And those peace has helped you. After you drink those peace, you felt so much better, but yes. there was dizziness. Yes. Huh? Yes. yes. Uh, and now this thing is over today in Jesus' name. Amen. You are free. You are free today. This thing will never happen to you. You, when you sleep here, there's a problem. Uh -huh. Come on, it's a demon. This demon must leave you. Come on, you demon. Put a mic in your mouth here. 
You will hear what she's saying. It's another language. She'll die. Another. She'll die. Huh? She'll die. She'll die. I will not go out. So you want to kill her? Die. Yes, I'll kill her. Yeah, you can I'll see. Kill. So, kill her. those are the things that Mr. Tanke can tell you. I want to kill her. Why? How do you want to kill her? Huh? I, I, How do you want to kill her? Who knows this lady? Who knows her? I know that uh, when someone is like this, you are no longer knowing. <laughs> so you want you want to kill her? Yes. Huh? What what, uh, what is that you put in the heart? What is that you put there? I'll finish it. You finish it. So, force herself to come here. Huh? She will die. So you were blocking her? Yes! I even made the car to stop. Huh? Who are okay. you who's doing this? Huh? From a... From a... From a house. From a what? From a house. Which house? Namibia. Namibia? Yes. Oh, she's from Namibia? Okay, leave her now. Leave her today. You must never enter her again in Jesus' name. You are defeated. Leave it. In the name of Jesus. I cut your head now. In Jesus' name. This is a hidden demon that always hides here. Jesus' name. Come on. Out in the name of Jesus. You are defeated in the name of Jesus. Jesus name. Jesus name. Jesus name. This was supposed to be a stroke as you can see. Jesus name. You are defeated. Leave it, your spirit. Can you just go to this woman? It's a spirit that. Oh, come on. Can you see that? Put a. Eh? What? What is your problem? Why eh? did she come here? Come here. Do I didn't want her to come. Why she was she getting lost. Here? She was getting lost in the old church. I didn't want her. wanted her to go home. Why did she? Why you did wanted she her to go home. Why did she answer the phone? To come at the old church in Tempisa. Can you talk? Can you talk? Don't talk like you are, someone is chasing you here. What, what is your problem? Huh? You say what? Why did she come? Why did she come? You never wanted her to come. Why you didn't want her to come? She must suffer. Must suffer. Mm, who are you? Who are you who's doing that? She must leave my son. She must leave your son. She must go and so, kill him. So where is the husband? She's there at home. He's there at home. So what are you doing to her? Huh? The business is not working. The business? The children okay. are not going to school. You can leave her. You can leave her now. You leave her. You leave her forever and don't enter her again. She must go. Eh? She must go. I don't want her in my family. You don't want her. Can you hear that? This lady has been married. Then we, we don't want to say, Mama, what? The spirits of the family. We have to say that. The spirits of the family doesn't want her. Because if now we begin to talk about woman who doesn't want it, these are spirits who are using people in the family. Sometimes you enter the family, you are supposed to deliver the family, or you are bringing blessing to the family. So these are the spirits. In the family, there are spirits. Now this one, she has come to the family. So those spirits, they don't want it. So they can use anybody to act, but it's them. They put a person in front. You understand? And that person doesn't have power by themselves, they are using the person. So that's the situation. 
So today you are free in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. You are living here in the name of Jesus. Come on. Come on. You can see what she's doing. The things were there at the feet. They throw things there. She walk on to and she get those things. Come on. Yeah? You are going. Do that very fast. I count three. One, two, three. In Jesus' name. You are defeated. Come. In Jesus' name. This demon, you demon, who are trying to be a husband in the night, you are defeated now. What are you doing to her? Sister, listen, my sister. Uh, tell me this. Who's hating you where you are married? Uh, all I know is my in-laws, they don't like me. Huh? My in-laws. Yes, you must love them. I try. No, do that. Do you want to divorce your husband? No. Eh? No. Uh, yeah. So you must love them. Amen. You understand? Amen. Yes. If you don't want to divorce the husband, love them. Amen. You understand? Yes. You will change them. Amen. But if you want to divorce your husband, hate them. Amen. And then you can go. You understand? Amen. Do you still love your husband? Yes. Yes. So if you love your husband, love them because they're the ones who give birth to your husband. Amen. You don't have a husband if you don't have them. Amen. You understand? Yes. God, God bless you. Amen. Thank you. Touch your stomach there. Come on. So these are people who have problems of the chest. Problem of the chest. demon doesn't want you to marry. This demon is trying to be your husband. He's defeated this demon today. Hold your chest. Hold your chest. Huh? What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Can you just get another one? Otherwise we won't finish. Another one. Let's bring another one. Come. Move. Come on, you leave that chest, you demon. Come on, come on. In Jesus' name, let's bring another one. Come on. Come on, you spirit, leave this chest. Let's bring another one. Come on. Hey, come on. You demon. You hidden demon. Let's bring another one. Come on. Hold your chest. Jesus' name. You are coughing. You are free. Let's bring another one. Hold your chest. Jesus' name. Come on, you demon. 